Now we're going to change styles. The next track is a rock feel. So let's listen to it and we'll talk about some of our options. So there you hear the form. Two different chords. It's a B and an A. They're a whole step apart. Straight eighth, drive and groove. One and two and three and four. Got a big fat saturated guitar sound. Playing a lot of power chords. Different voicings that are coming out of the appropriate modes. Power chords that are not just on the bottom end. So that really changes how you can solo. Because notice it's not just the same static rhythm guitar part. Here are all those little ideas that are being fed to the soloist via the rhythm guitar. Here are the climbing chords right there. And that's important because that was at the end of the phrase. So that supports you when you're soloing. Notice what has happened now. The whole texture's changed. Clean sound, chorus and delay, very sparkly, very transparent. So you're not going to dig in and play the same ripping kind of solo you did over the power chords. You'll change your tone, you'll actually change how you solo. This is the perfect example of an extended solo with a rock trio or four piece group. All these small partial of chords up in the high register. You hear the repetition, how an idea is stated, and it's played with sufficient variation to not be boring, but it establishes the theme. Don't neglect, don't just think about the harmony and the notes, think of the rhythms that are stated with these guitar parts. Because the drums and the bass are just holding down the groove with this straight eighth feel. Now it's kind of calmed down again. So this rise and this fall of energy is important when you're constructing your solo. Here how it's come down, it's just simmering right now, just grooving along. There you have the outro, same figures being played, subtle little variations here and there. Coming to a close. Light texture and a fade out. In the next section, we'll talk about what your melodic options are as well as your rhythmic options.